Hey guys, so if you've bought yourself the brand new DJI Osmo 3 gimbal and uh, if you're wondering how to set it up, maybe you do know how to set it up but you know we're going to walk you through the proper way to put your phone on the gimbal and balance it because balancing the gimbal is what gives you this amazing battery life that DJI claims its devices to have. So let's just go ahead and see exactly what you need to do in order to balance your smartphone on the DJI gimbal. First off, when you buy the DJI Osmo 3, you'll also get this uh, little tripod-like thing. This is actually to help you balance the phone on your gimbal properly. So you just screw it in at the bottom over here and then you can put it on a table so that it's flat, it's stable and there are absolutely no uh, shakes or it doesn't fall over or anything of that sort. Then you take your phone and just put it into the smartphone holder over here and that's fine now as you can see this phone is actually not sitting straight on the gimbal that means it's out of balance one it's actually tipping way too much to the uh, left side in this case so i'm just gonna push you push it all the way to the right till it stays centered so there we go It is now centered uh, roughly there we go perfectly centered right now the other problem is sometimes what you will notice is that the phone after you've put it in the gimbal tends to either fall forwards or backwards this is because maybe the phone could uh, you know be causing an uneven weight distribution so for example it could be like this um, or falling forward or falling backward so the way you take care of that is by essentially moving this back part over here up and down so these are rails that will allow you to shift the weight of the phone in the top down axis so if you just do a little bit of that you see okay it's become a little top heavy you push it back down and then again it's still a little top heavy so you push it down a little bit more and then your phone will should be perfectly centered a little bit there we go now when i hold when i set the phone at zero zero and i leave it it's perfectly balanced now when you turn on the gimbal what's going to happen is this I'll do that and then you can go into your horizontal condition the reason we balance the gimbal is simple if the phone by default is balanced and its center of gravity is centered completely then the motors on the gimbal will not have to work hard or they'll actually not even have to work at all to sort of bring the camera back into the straight orientation however if your phone is completely out of balance then it'll put a lot of load on both the motors over here and over here to bring the phone to balance one causing the motors to heat up which reduces the overall lifespan also it eats up into your battery life like anything the 14 to 15 hour battery life that is claimed by DJI for the Osmo 3 actually stands true if you balance the gimbal properly. If you don't, then that life could be reduced to something as small as one hour even. So that's a quick look at how you balance the DJI uh, Osmo 3 gimbal. And this works with any smartphone. Pro tip, make sure to take the case off before you put the phone on because with a case, your phone may not even fit into the clamp. So that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video and it's been helpful to you. Thank you guys for watching.